What's up, Pisces? My name is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Um, I'm here to do your mid-March through April 2020 uh, love reading. Um, so, um, remember, time is fluid. So it could have been already happened, currently happening, or is about to happen. And remember, energy is fluid um, and can be reversed. Oh, my cat's a little crazy. Hold on a second. Oh, sorry. Um, and energy is fluid. So it could be um, embodied. It could take on the energies of the person you're thinking of or you, or it could be reversed. So and remember, if it doesn't apply, let it apply. So, all right, let's get started. Um, I already cleansed my space. I already cleansed my space. So um, here we go. Oh, remember this is for Pisces. Sorry, Pisces out there. Pisces, Pisceans. My beautiful, lovely Pisceans. Oh, and always, uh, real quick before we get started. Um, if you like this video and it resonates with you, um, remember to hit like, subscribe, and share. I'd really, really appreciate it. Um, I just started this channel literally tonight, um, but I would really love to continue making videos for you guys. And so, oh, and if you want to donate to the channel, uh, the link is in the description box below. Anyways, much love and light to you guys. Just wanted to say that real quick before we start. Here we go. All right, Spirit, what messages do you have for Pisces? Um, March 2020 through April 2020. Spirit, what messages do you have for Pisces? March 2020 through April 2020. What messages do you have for Pisces? March 2020 April 2020. Spirit, what message do you have for Pisces? March 2020 April 2020. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, we got the full in reverse. Fool and upright is um, freedom, fearlessness, um, manifestation, um, reverse, it is feeling stuck. It's kind of like the hangman in a way, um, and fearful. Okay, next one we've got uh, three of wands, which is um, uh, upright. which is um, Aries Leo Sag energy. It's um, successful, um, efforts being rewarded. That's nice. All right, next is Hangman. Um, the, okay, so this is more stuck energy, um, not able to move on, and it was upright. Next one is um, Four of Wands, which is like, it's happy home, or happy house, happy spouse kind of thing. It's um, fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sag. Um, it is stability. It's um, stability in the home. It's um, very happy, centered, grounded energy. Like I said, happy house, happy spouse. Everybody strives for this. Well, us normal people strive for this. There are crazy folks out there that just like to tear up homes and marriages. But normal folks, that's what we strive for. All right. 
Next one is Ten of Wands. Um, and this was an upright, and this is a responsibility or burden. Um, it's fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sag, too. Lots of fire up in here. Lots of fire. No majors. Well, one major. We got the full. Two majors, sorry. Hangman full. Um, but it's Ten of Swords is major backstabbing and I don't mean they stuck one wand up in that motherfucker or even five wands up in your motherfucking back I mean they stuck all ten wands up in your motherfucking back I mean they stabbed the hell out of it like the hell out of it there ain't no more stabbing that motherfucker can do sorry excuse my language but it's just truth okay so oh lord let's see what's going on here Okay. We got some stuff going on. All right, so we've got stuck, 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 not able to move, stuck, stuck, stuck. Then you're stuck, but you get some kind of success, some something, some something you were awarded for something. Um, so some sort of success, regardless of the stuckness over here, you're getting some kind of success, some kind of reward. So that's good. Um, then you get more stuck energy, still, still stuck, but you got rewarded. So, so that's good. Then you get four wands. So you're stuck, oh, you're stuck, you're getting rewarded, you're still stuck, but then you get happy house, happy uh, spouse. So you're you're getting good out of this or it seems like you're getting good out of this it looks like to be honest it looks like almost a facade in a way because you're stuck you're getting some reward you're still stuck you're, it seems like you're getting the four on one. It's a happy spouse, happy house. But you're getting so damn betrayed. It's like you don't even know it. So it seems like, you know, the happy home, happy spouse. Oh, we're all in our PJs in a Christmas photo. Looking all happy with our kids and our dogs, our two point five uh animals and kids and a white picket fence sorry y'all and my kitty cat striker um but it's like there's you are getting so motherfucking betrayed i'm so sorry but your man or uh woman whoever it is um she's he or she or unidentifiable, whoever it may be. Um, hopefully it's not. Oh, sorry, but, you know. Not trying to uh, offend anybody on YouTube, but, you know, it's what it is. But, um, whoever it is, your significant other, they're betraying the hell out of you. I mean, not one, one not, not one, ten, ten, which is the most you can do. So it's like a, a big con man or a big con woman because they want you to think that you got happy house, happy spouse, and they, um, and they want to keep you stuck. Oh, they want to keep you stuck and they keeping you stuck and you're getting some reward out of this, but they flying by night, honey bunny, at the night, nighttime, I guarantee you, I guarantee you. That's the most you. That's the most wanted you can stab in somebody's back. I'm sorry, but that's the truth. Ooh, Lord. Okay, well, this doesn't look very pretty, so we'll get some healing oracle cards over here. I am so sorry. I just want to say, I am so sorry for whoever is going through this, because this. This looks honestly like somebody 
that's trying to keep you in looking like you're a trophy wife or a trophy husband and going flying by night behind your back. That's exactly what it looks like. I ain't gonna lie to you. And I'm so, if this is, I am so sorry this is happening to somebody or is happening or is going to happen to somebody. Oh, Lord. All right, here we go. Spirit, what message do you have for Pisces? Mid-March 2020 through April 2020. Spirit. Spirit messages you have. Pisces, mid-March 2020 through April 2020. Oh. Okay. We'll just take the top one. Okay. So you see the cards. <clears throat> All right. Old feelings are resurfacing, and again, you'll find yourself on an emotional roller coaster. Don't fight it. Instead, allow these feelings to surface without judging them. They are neither good nor bad. They are simply a part of you. Own them, embrace them, and love them. Bless the past and be grateful for the deep and profound healing that is taking place. So, to me, that honestly really goes with the, the reading. I mean, it really, really does. So, I would just take this as healing to moving forward from if this has already happened or is going to happen or has happened. Just, I would take this as a healing message for that because that's some effed up BS, to be honest with you. It really is. But honestly, we all know that's real life. And I would rather somebody to be prepared for this um, then it sneak up on them because honey bunny it's go it's coming if it hadn't come it's coming and it's coming big that ain't five swords that's ten swords up in your back alright alright let's get one more <clears throat> spirit and this is the lover's oracle by the way um, oracle deck Spirit, what messages do you have for Pisces, um, March 2020 through April 2020? Spirit, what messages did you have for Pisces? Oh, oh, Lord. We can't take hold it. They on fire now. Spirit, what message do you have for Pisces? March 2020. This one wants to come out. A magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at present. Enjoy it. So, well, it sounds like you're moving on. Is what it sounds like, which would probably be the smart thing, to be honest with you. Um, let me get a clarifier real quick before I close this reading. Let me get a clarifier for um, the Ten of Wands. Spirit, what messages do you have for Pisces? Oh, okay. Um, the Hermit. In reverse. Yeah, so moving on. That's, yeah, that's, I mean, which clarifies the passion. So that makes complete sense. Okay. All right, well, that closes out your reading. I really hope that helped, Pisces. If you liked my video and it resonated with you, um, please uh, click like, subscribe, and share. I would really, really, really appreciate it. I just started the video, um, just started the channel just literally tonight or yesterday night. It's in the morning now, early wee hours. Um, but I really enjoy doing these readings for you guys, and um, I would really like to continue. So if you liked it, um, like, subscribe, share. I'd really appreciate it. If you'd like a personal reading, uh, check the information in the description box. And um, if you want to donate to the channel, which all donations, no matter what amount they are, um, would be very greatly appreciated. All right. Peace, love, and light to all.